Hello there. Yes. Um, I'm sorry for not um making a video sooner, as I did promise one a couple of days after the last update. But I, I was going to do one, but I didn't really know what to update about. So here we are. I thought, well, I still haven't really got anything to update you on, but I thought I have to make one my viewers, to get my viewers up and subscribers and things, so yes. Um, one thing I can talk about is I went to see a clairvoyant. The I went Friday morning, um, yesterday morning. Um, it was really weird because we booked it and then had to cancel. And booked it again and then went to the shop. And it was all closed up, and I said to Mom, I said, why is it closed up at appointment at 7? And so we rang the man, and he said that apparently the night before we cancelled, and left a message on the answer machine cancelling. Um, and we, we never did, I mean, I didn't ring up, Mom didn't ring up, and no one else knew about it, so it was a bit freaking us out. Um, so we forgot that and we we hoped that they would show us the message but they never did so it remains a mystery. <laughs> um but now we went yesterday morning and it's quite interesting what he said. I've got a little C D of the recording, of the reading. And in one of my blogs I will play it to you. But not right now, as I don't know where I put it. <laughs> but um he said some quite interesting things really. Um, he said that I'm going to London at some point and I, but I won't stay long, I'll, I'll come back and he said I've got strong connections with Los Angeles and I will go there at some point um, mainly for uh, media based things and musical, like to do something musical and I'm going to get on with it, everyone really well and apparently I'm going to meet someone called Darren, I think it was, um, who plays guitar, um, and I'm going to live in a cottage, apparently, that's old-fashioned on the outside, but extremely modern on the inside, that's got a studio in the garden, I don't know, um, and he also said some things about the past, which were, you know, very true. So when I get a chance, I will play that CD for you, and then you can give me a comment. Comment if you want to ask anything about it, you know, I'll tell you what I can. Um, to be honest, I'm not really sure what to think of it, whether I believe it or not. I mean, we went to a show a couple of weeks ago, which is like, with the audience, you pick people out of the audience and, you know, give them a little bit of a reading and things. And everything he said in that show we got correct and we were shocked, that's why we decided to put the reading. So, um, but yeah, I think I believe what he said. But you, you can't really know whether to trust him or not, because really if he's saying things from the future you don't know, you can't prove it. You can't prove it if he's right or wrong, can you? So, but the things he said from the past were all correct, so... But yes, um, I was meant to do some filming last week. Um, I didn't get round to it as I was very busy. Sorry about that. Mm. But I, as soon as I can, I will get back to it and I'll let you know. And hopefully I'll do another update soon, in a few days probably. I won't promise to promise last time. And sorry, I broke that promise. <laughs> um, but how's everyone? Comment. I'll let you go. I'm here. <laughs> I said, yeah.